Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Um, in this video, I'm gonna be showing you the new um SSC Tuatara Aggressor. This is the um basically this the more the newer upgraded um track focused one. I wanna say um I'll show you the stats right here. It let's scroll down all the way. Come on. This game is so many cars, not even funny. Um, so, um, it's called the SSC Tonkala Strong. Top speed 288, handling 9.3 and drivetrain rear wheel drive. Now, um, we're going to drag race this car, circuit race it, and then I'm going to tell you what I think about it. Before we start, um, don't, um, don't forget to like and subscribe. helps a lot. And um, it really encourages me to keep on pushing and making crazy amounts of videos and all that. It just really helps. It keeps me motivated. Um, but I also want to thank you for all the support in, these, in the last few videos. I'm getting like hundreds of views, and that's crazy. <sighs> I love it. Thank you for watching, and let's get in. So, um, the first thing we're going to do is a drag race because. My friend here, Bear, by the way, shout out to him for letting me use his car for this review. But, um, this, this, yeah, he let me test it before I started this video, and it's, it's kind of crazy. So, um, yeah. Wait, did that just restart? What? Or does it like 25 seconds? Um, So, um, we're gonna do drag. Okay, um, there we go. First gear, second gear, third. Jeez, this thing ain't slow. Fourth, and the fourth seems it seems like slow down a tiny bit, tuned down. Then it fourths like at 170 miles an hour. And in a drag race, especially in like the big the actual drag race which I'm gonna teleport to right now um ooh yay someone I can race um let's see if I can race this round or the next one and we're gonna do the one half mile and then we're gonna test the we're just gonna test how long the gears are so um looks like they took the longest race so we're just gonna wait for them yeah, I can't believe how far our channels, this channel's gone. And thank you guys so much for the... Uh, just subscribing, watching. And I hope you guys are having a good time doing it too. Because this stuff, this stuff's fun. Sometimes it's hard to post. Sometimes it's hard to keep up daily schedule and all that. But it's so fun. It just, it just is. I don't know. Like, it's, it's just, it's so fun. But yeah, we're gonna do the one half mile just to test top speed. And I should be able to beat this seven. Um, I should be able to tell by the exhaust. That's the seven. Um. Uh, seven. Oh, I keep on forgetting them. Seven twenty-five S. I don't know. Um. Yeah, let's go. First gear, second gear, third. Fourth, okay, fourth seems to go a tiny bit slower. Okay, great. There's fifth. Fifth seems to like bog down a tiny bit. But that is some crazy speed there. Um I watched T Stingray's video he posted on this. He was able to get up to two twenty something. So uh, yeah, this thing definitely gets more faster if you don't hit the wall. But now we're gonna test it on the most important thing for this car, which is the circuit race. This car was built and designed for the circuit, and then um, I'm going to do one lap of that, and then after that, we're just going to do City Race, and then that should be good. Um, yeah, so let's start this. One lap. Okay. So, um, yeah. Um, ooh, we're going up against a Bentley now. Ooh. So I'm trying to look snazzy in the Bentley. That Bentley actually looks sick, not going to lie. Mm -hmm. Yeet. 
by the way, um, if, if you guys don't know how to do this, this is I and O. It's just so fun to do this. Passes time. But, um, yeah, let's get into this. So, I do, this is actually a re-recording, because in the first one, number one, I did terrible in the circuit race. And number two, I lost Wi-Fi. So, um, let's see how I do this time. Okay, there we go. It has extreme punch out of these corners. Jeez. Um... I'm not the best circuit driver, and I have a laggy game, so, yep, as you just saw, lag, live on TV, yep, yep, lag, as seen on TV, lol, <laughs> but, um, I wouldn't say I'm doing too bad right now, I'm definitely not gonna get record times in, in this, yep, <sighs> okay, we're gonna turn here, turn here, and, I know you, um, you can definitely do better in this car than 52.8 seconds, but, um, yeah, I'm just, I'm just terrible. Like, you could probably do, like, 30-something, I want to say, in this car. Not as good as the Sesto. The Sesto's just insanely OP, but, yeah. Um, as we're driving to the city, this thing feels, oh, so good. Man, I can't wait to get my hands on this. I'm telling you, I will get my hands on this. Like, besides the video I just posted of me grinding in Drive World, I haven't really grinded at all. Except for that. So, um... Woohoo! This is some sharp breaks. This thing looks so much nicer visually than the, um, other thing. Um, yeah, so I'm just telling them to make a vid because I like. Um. It. So, um. We're just gonna wait for this to end. Oh, and yeah. If I didn't already see it, big shout out to Bear. Yeah. He made this video possible for me. Like. I can't believe he, like, had 17 million. That was, like, perfect timing. But, yeah. This 2x event's helping so much right now. Um. Let's see here. While I'm doing that, I'm gonna... I'm gonna spawn him this. Um. There we go. You can have that. Yeah, yeah. We've got the Atlantic. Um. So as we're waiting, yeah, yeah, yeah. What race did they do? Jeez. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Um. Um. This could take a while because you're doing highway. This thing does very good donuts. So far, I haven't exactly done the city race and finished the review, but I'd say, for the money, this car, if you're a circuit person, this car is, um, this car's worth it. 100%. And if, if you're just a rich guy who collects limiteds, um, I'm not exactly rich, but I do collect limiteds, so, um, I am going to get this, um, if you're just a person who likes to brag about their cars, I'd also consider getting this because it's 19 million. But if you're a person who just wants to be on a budget and not spend way too much, this probably ain't the car for you. Um, the the normal SSC uh, has active aero, even though it's slightly older and doesn't look as good in my opinion. Um, it still only goes 6 miles an hour less, I believe. And, um, yeah. This thing, this thing isn't even as fast as the F5, sadly. They really need to buff it. But, um, in real life, this goes over 300. So is the, um, Hennessy Venom in real life. 
a lot of cars are slowed down. So we're gonna do the city race. Um, yeah. Okay, so I got one of my friends that needs to charge. Let's get into this. Almost at three mil, yes. Okay. We're just gonna do one lap or whatever that says. Yeah, yeah, one lap. The city race I I do it quite often, so it's relatively easy for me to do. But we're going against a Venom F five, so anything could really happen. Oh, this is actually a good showdown though. Because the Venom F five is the car I was talking about. Yeah, this thing's gonna destroy an acceleration. Um, we're not gonna talk about that. Yeah, yeah. you did not see that. We're just gonna turn. Is yeah, this thing is extremely sharp and precise turning? It's not the it's not the bleeds perfect ten turning, obviously nine point three, but jeez, this is crazy. I think I th I don't think it's a nine point three. It might say it, but it doesn't feel like it. This feels like eleven. Like, I've never been in the Bugatti Bolide, like, test it and driven it, but this thing, this thing's up there, man. Okay, and I crashed, so you could probably get around 50 seconds in this if you don't crash. Yeah. I'm just, wait, what? We're doing two laps? Okay. I guess, yeah, I can prove myself in this lap. So, um, turn, accelerate, and and when I say that, I crash. It's it's so nice, isn't it? Just being on your lead in the race and then crashing. Now I don't know what happened that F five, but um, I'm gone. This thing turns so good. This thing is amazing at turning. Yeah. So if you're a circuit racer or a person who does races, who loves cornering and challenging races, this is so the car for you. And if you've got money, this is a car for you. But if you're just... Yeah, I want to see an average person CDT with around $10 million, I want to say. Okay, 49 seconds, that isn't bad. You could probably do better if you don't crash like I did. I could probably get 45 in this, I want to say. You know, I've done good. So, um, overall, I'm going to I'm gonna rate this for just looks. Oh, we haven't actually given it a good look yet. Why not? Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we, what we got right here. Insane. Look at this. Oh, I love the gray and the orange that my friend decided to design. But this thing looks insane. Um, You can see the engine right here. That looks insane. It, it literally looks like nitro shooting out of there. But, um, yeah. I would rate this car a 9 out of 10 just because it isn't as fast and it, it just isn't as fast as I was expecting. I was hoping it would be faster. Uh, um, we're not going to talk about what's happening to my hair right now in the, my avatar, but yeah. So, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. I'll see you guys in the next video, yeah. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe. It helps a lot again. And thank you so much for your all your support lately. See you next one. Bye.